Greetings! I had a request from a friend of mine to do an apartment tour video. Um, now that I am mostly moved into my new apartment, um, I've actually been living here almost a year and it's really sad that up until like yesterday I didn't feel like I was completely moved in and didn't feel like I could have people in my apartment. Um, finally got my button gear and moved everything in. So, um, the exception being there are a few, okay, quite a lot of artwork pieces that I haven't hung up yet and a couple of other collectible items that I haven't unpacked but do have places to go. Um, but I, like I said, got a request to go ahead and do this video, so I thought I would show you guys my apartment. Here we go. All right, so here's my front door. Um, I still have my Christmas wreath up because I want to put something else there and I don't know what yet. Um, and my lovely number sign on my door. Um, my door actually did not come with numbers on it for some reason, even though everyone else's did. So I made the sign and it's just magnetic because my door is metal. And now I have a pretty, pretty number sign. Okay. So right when you walk in, there's some cat food and you walk into the kitchen um, so here's my kitchen super exciting it's small but it functions well for me I've got room for my microwave and my food processor a nice big double sink got some you know super exciting things in canisters pretty standard stove oven coffee maker this really cute pig cutting board my Dad made this in his high school wood shop class and it's gotten some burns on it over the years. I just think it's really cute so that's one of my favorite decorations in my kitchen. Fridge! I keep all of my resin magnets on my fridge. Some are mine that I'm keeping and some are for sale but I figure may as well stick them on the fridge. So yeah, super exciting kitchen. Um, so then you pass through the kitchen into the dining area, shall we call it. It's not really a room, it's just kind of a corner of the living room. But I just have room for a table, kind of tucked into the corner and a couple of chairs. I have these really nice, really cool prints that are huge. They're really brightly colored. And my grandma actually gave these to me and thought they would look nice in my dining room. And they will look awesome in my dining room when I bother to hang them on the wall. Um... You can see on the floor there, that's the rest of the artwork that I haven't hung up because lazy. I just haven't had time and every time I think about where I want to put things, I change my mind all the time so I didn't want to start banging nails into the wall yet but yeah. Um, and then over here I have my little bar area. There's not much on it. I have a very poorly stocked bar. That's because in my last apartment, the kitchen was smaller than this one and I literally had nowhere to put any of this stuff. So I would just buy some wine every once in a while but never really have anywhere to put it. So I'm working on getting this baby stocked up. Anyway, so then I have... Um, there's a big sliding door there. My blinds are closed because it's nighttime. But I do have a balcony, which is nice. I've got room for... I've got a chair and a little table I can sit out there and eat and I have some plants growing. This is the cat's favorite rug. And this is my living room. I have a nice big living room. Makes me very happy. There's some more artwork that hasn't been hung up yet. Um, in the corner over there with the cover over it is the hedgehog cage. This is my favorite chair. This is like a $400 designer chair and I found it at a Peddler's Mall for like $75. It's my favorite thing. Cute little couch, decorative things, coffee table, other chair. Um, Jasper, say hi. He's walking around waiting for dinner. Let me back up a little. There's my entertainment center. Um, I have all my DVDs are alphabetized down here. And then I have a different one for games. I've got other storage in there. And then just little knickknacks on the shelves. Pictures of friends. Picture of the cat. Hedgehog things. 
giant Erlenmeyer flask full of My Little Ponies, basket o' cat toys, cat tower, and then I have these three bookshelves here that have some collectibles on them as well as books and then I have some storage boxes at the bottom for different things. Over here is my Zatanna collection. Um, this is the newest figure I got. I got this really awesome statue. And that really made me run out of room. So at some point I'll have to expand onto two shelves. This is my travel apothecary that a friend of mine made. So it's like a little Harry Potter potion kit. Very cool, love it. I have some general nerdy kind of things over here. I got a couple of Hello Kitty figures, Ursula, a little Monster High Gulia, and a little Narwhal. And then I have my Doctor Who stuff. Up here I've got a Swamp Thing, John Constantine, Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, Batgirl, Cat. He likes to jump up on top of there. Hi. And then I have my cameras here, both film and digital. Comic books, more books, etc. Some more artwork that I haven't hung. Artwork that I have hung. What? And then you go down the hallway here. And this is just a closet. I hung a curtain instead of a door so the cat can go in there and use the litter box. And then here's my bathroom. Focus camera. It's a cute little bathroom. It's got, you know, like faux wood floors. My favorite shower curtain with elephants on it. Some nice artwork. Nail polish rack. Yep, that's the bathroom. And then here is the bedroom. Whoa! It's a really big bedroom, I love that. Um, so I do have double closets. I have a full wall of closets, which is awesome. They're full of things. Um, this shelf over here is where my custom My Little Ponies that I own are going to live. I have not unpacked them yet. These are ones that I've gotten since I moved in, so that's why they're here. And then I have my desk and my craft area. Um, I hopefully will do a craft area video at some point, but there are some things out and about so things aren't all put away, so I don't really want to do a video until I can show where everything really goes. And then I have my My Little Pony collection over here. Got some little guys up on the wall. I have ribbons for custom and costume contests that I've won for My Little Pony. My awesome collection. Here is my Barnacle Army. Barnacle is my favorite My Little Pony, so I have a lot of him. And I have a lot of custom items. They're beauteous. And then I have my dolls are up here, my G3 ponies, don't mind the kitty box. I have to keep one in the bedroom because I have one cat who, well, the cats don't get along, let's just say that. So I have to keep a cat box in here so that they have separate places to go. There's a fish tank. Let's see if I can zoom and find fish. There's Fish, he's up in the top corner there. There's my beta tank. And my bed. With a cat toy in the middle of it, cause I had to be given some prey. And dresser. This little dude here has got a bunch of makeup and jewelry in it. It's got toothless in it. And yeah, so that's my apartment. Um, just need some more artwork hung, a few little things brought out. There's Jasper. Say hi, kitty kitty. Whoa. Jasper. Focus camera. Focus. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. So yeah, 
that's my apartment.